Yo, what's going on team? I hope you're all having a good time. I hope you all had a great weekend. I had a good weekend. Um, shaved my beard, stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, in this video I want to go over a couple of charts. Let's see what we got for the upcoming week. Let's do a little analysis. Um, yeah, but before that I want to show you some results of our students. I've got a lot of crazy messages from people who are flipping like small accounts like crazy. All right, let's start with Stuart. So he just flipped. What was going on? Like he made 1,300 in a week. That's cool. Then we got another one. He just, yeah, he had a $5,000 account and he flipped it to. 15,000 so yeah he just tripled his account on one trade and we got another one he had a $350 account flipped it to more than 4,000 then William was on a demo account and he started with 3,000 and then he had 9,000 profits so he made four times his account then we have this this guy over here Zaban he started with a $250 account and flipped it to over 1100 that's cool then we have Lee over here man he 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 been going crazy the last week let me tell you guys look at that on one day on gold he just made like 12 grand profit and then he made a withdrawal of 14700 <laughs> Then he was asking me about taxes, guys. If you want to know something about taxes with uh, when it comes to forex trading, just Google it. Just Google it, or uh, ask an uh, ask an accountant. He will he will help you. Um, yeah. Then we got another one, Wangani. Man, he made a crazy flip on gold. He just flipped fifty dollar into th ten thousand eight hundred look at that guys he literally flipped a six yeah it was 58 dollars like 60 dollar account into more than 10,800 guys wow that's crazy <laughs> that's crazy that must be a new re record and then we have Stan Briggs he has some positions running more than 23 grand on the clock then we have Tony, he flipped $200 into $800. Then we have uh, Tekas from the Inner Circle group chat. He made 1,200 profit in a day and withdraw instantly 1,400. Yeah, and Lee is just smashing it there. He, I think this was before he was cashing out. Yeah, he was going his equity curve going from nine grand to 17 grand man he been he wouldn't he been just smashing it last week and yeah now he's finally at the withdrawal getting some money out of the broker guys if you are if you are new to this channel yeah, if you if you don't know what we are doing and let me tell you these guys they study the genius trading masterclass course you know you will find everything inside of there like the genius trading masterclass course is different you like nobody else got this kind of stuff inside of their courses you know we trade we trade the genius way like people are telling telling you like it's unrealistic to make like 15 percent a month or whatever guys if you know what to do and if you're able to load it up on a good run if you know how that works you can even make like these crazy flips you've you've just seen uh, one minute ago like the flips that I show you guys this is possible you know and the genius trading masterclass course makes the impossible possible I mean it seems impossible but it is possible if you play it clever and this is what you're gonna learn inside of the in, inside of the course so yeah check out the genius trading masterclass course guys you will find the link in the description below if you have any questions you can drop me a message i'm gonna i'm gonna answer you as quick as possible if you need any help maybe i'm gonna forward you to one of my friends who are trading with me maybe they're gonna help you 
let's see but if you need some help make sure to drop me a message you will find the link in the description and don't forget to join the public telegram channel to stay updated sometimes i share some analysis some trade entries access results or useful uh, useful youtube videos educational content motivation or whatever guys make sure to check out the free telegram channel join and yeah let's uh, let's smash it and now let's get into the charts all right so we have on gold last week we catch this nice breakout to the upside made some good money and then after it retraced catched another good move to the upside but then non-farm payrolls kicked in and yeah as you can see the last daily candle was kind of indecisive so winners and buys are like they are even so it was pretty balanced it was going up and down uh, nothing to get crazy about like same thing in us 30 us 100 and uh, us 500 market was going up and down on friday like crazy but yeah what do we have on gold let's see mm, for now for now i'm not sure what to do like i would just keep watching it because it's still bouncing around around that that level we don't know yet how the market will continue let's see what was going on upcoming week on monday i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna chill see what's going on uh, during the midnight session and all that stuff like i'm just gonna watch the chart and see if it wants to go down or if it wants to go up and then i'm trying to get a nice uh, get a nice move uh, in the in the direction of the where the market wants to move you know so yeah we just gotta check the chart see what's up and then move with the flow of the market we have a couple of levels over here like let's see let's check the four hour chart I've marked up a couple of significant zones where the price could probably want to go or where we have some targets or obstacles. You see this, like this high, this high over here, this high over there, this high, this high, and this high. So yeah, we just need to see what the market wants to do. Let's let's see what who's in control of the market of if the buyers in control of the market or the sellers and then and then just move with the flow of the market guys this is how we do it and if we got it if if, if we got a nice entry then and if we got if we're on the right side of the trade then we load it up we load it up and see how far we can later on easy easy okay Dow jones was good on Dow jones guys um yeah kind of kind of bouncing in this channel with a huge five five day push to the upside and then last day was indecisive so i think yeah buyers are exhausted for now but let's see what happens if the market start starts dropping on monday tuesday let's see maybe it will come back and move to the downside of the channel we don't know yet we just have to see what the market is doing check it out see if the structure breaks i mean we have kind of a structure over here you see on the four hour chart boom going up and down up and down now yeah it seems like it's slowing down around in this area over here which is a good sign if we see if we see sellers stepping in then why not writing right writing this thing to the downside and then of course yeah we can we, we can mark up some levels where we can expect some yeah kind of pressure obstacles where people are going to take some profits let's see what we have like 27 500 seems like a like a decent level something something like this this is it this is where we're gonna see some action of course what else and the bottom over here as well and this one 
like the market is not perfect guys that's why we use these uh, zones you know you have really have to ch see what's what's going on when the market hits that zone like we could use we could we could use a horizontal ray for example like this but the market is not moving like this it's not that straight that perfect you know the market is moving in yeah, in these kind of zones you know so this is why I prefer these rectangles you know? so yeah these are these are some target these are some zones where we can uh, where we can that we can target like you can you can you can do it like this or like this or make it just a little bit bigger you know and just see what's going on like try to write a write the structure write the structure guys I mean this is a one hour chart if you break it down to lower time frame you can make a couple of trades you can make a couple of trades in between in between these uh, in between these uh, significant levels you know let's see maybe we can get a nice drop like this again but we will see guys you, you need to read you need to read the structure and read the candles I mean you can see who's in control you can see what's going on and then you can make your decision based on what the market is telling you you know you have to yeah read what the market is trying to tell you and then act act on that you know okay same thing on nasdaq we have something like a, yeah like something like a little channel over here so what the market is going to do next we will see maybe it will break out to the upside or will come down bounce around in this channel we will see and then it will break out to the upside or to the downside this is this is uh, what will happen and yeah only thing we can do is move with the flow of the market guys and let's see what's going on last week was strong bullish very strong bullish I didn't expect that because I was thinking like damn this election and all that stuff um, maybe the economy is um, is shaking a little bit but let's see let's see what's going to happen next I'm ready for sales. I'm ready for buys. Let's see. I don't know why. My I, I, the last trades that I took on on Dow Jones, Nasdaq, or SP 500. I don't know. It's not my market. I I, I should stick with gold. Like I like to trade gold. I kind of yeah. I kind of feel what the market is trying to tell me. But I, I think Dow Jones, US 100, they moving, they moving different. It's, it's a different story, and that's why it's so important, especially at the beginning. Or, yeah, I think, yeah, it's, it's, it's very important that you guys stick to one market or maximum two. But I think 80 to 90 percent of your trades should be on one market, guys. <clears throat> why is that? Um, I feel like traders are more should should be more specialist than um, all rounder. As a trader, we are specialists, and it's it's better to focus on just one market, especially if you're a day trader, guys. If you're a day trader, you you should focus on one market and just milk this market. One market is enough to make enough <laughs> a lot of money, you know. If you can make 50% accuracy, and if you are able to cut your losses quick and load it up on a good run, oh damn, you're gonna make so much money. That's crazy, guys. That's crazy. So yeah, keep it simple. This is what I want to say. Keep it simple, okay. And if you need any help, make sure to just drop me a message. Uh, me or my team, we, we're gonna help you. We're gonna help you get you on top. And yeah, if you're still watching at the sideline, guys, invest in your education. Get the Genius Trading Masterclass course. You're gonna learn everything inside of there. I got all the strategies inside. 
like everything is inside of there you know this this course will make you an independent consistently profitable trader and if you study the course one time and you attack the market and you fail you gotta study this thing more than once all right study it again and again and again and never give up you know i mean these are the course is around 100 lessons and i'm i'm gonna add a couple of more lessons soon because i'm working on on another um, strategy strategy that i want to put inside of the course and after that the price will gonna go up let's see i'm sure i'm gonna double the price for the course because it's worth it it's worth more than that <laughs> because people are making crazy money guys and yeah it's been a blessing for everybody and yeah you should make a quick decision if you're serious about becoming an independent trader work from home um living a trading lifestyle you know yeah you should get get on the team join the inner circle connect with all the traders from our team and make something happen you know and make some money i'm sure in the in the actual situation the economic situation many people losing their jobs like having a skill like this where you can benefit from for the rest of your life is crucial guys i mean you got this skill for the rest of your life so you can make money for the rest of your life if if you get it cracking like if you put the discipline and the effort in it i mean it's not easy it's a simple concept but the emotional side of that is pretty hard but if you get it and if you trade ice cold if you got your plan running guys you just need to stick to it you just need to stick to it and bank big time you know and this is what we do <laughs> yeah guys enjoy the rest of your weekend let's see what we got for the upcoming week next week i'm sure we're gonna smash it big time as always <laughs> I'm gonna stick to my plan. I wish you a great weekend. Make sure to join the team. Uh, we see us inside. Stay healthy. Peace out. Oh,